Oh, can we go in here? <laughs> Birthday parties are typically joyous occasions, but for Northwest's 11th birthday, drama took center stage. Let's delve into the surprising incident that left Kim Kardashian visibly upset. Here's how our bestie, Miss Miss Westie, celebrated her 11th birthday. Today is Northwest's birthday, so happy birthday, North! Yesterday, North and all of her friends were in matching pajamas and they were spotted at the American Dream Mall in New Jersey. I only know of this mall because Kim always takes her kids here when she's on the East Coast. And Northwest did also meet up with Kai Sanat. It looks like they're doing a little Color Me Mine setup, <laughs> which is comical if you watch this week's episode of The Kardashians. Kim also had a kind of recreation of the win, you guys. Is it necessary? at Joe's Pizza and it looks like they rented it out. But you can see here North and all of her friends in birthday merch. And I think North and all of her friends had a pizza lesson from Joe's, which is one of the Kardashians' favorite pizza places in New York. Also, Kim posted a picture with Kai Sinat. But I just can't get over this because not only was Kai Sinat there, I think they went back to the American Dream Mall to go ride roller coasters and Kai and Ray are there as well. I already know. Ray and Northwest, are you kidding me? That is everything I can piece together right now from Northwest birthday weekend. On on June 15th, Northwest celebrated her 11th birthday with a grand party at the American Dream Mall in New Jersey, a fitting venue for a festive gathering. The event was attended by close friends and family, including Kim Kardashian, her best friend Lala Anthony, and popular influencer Kai Sinet. Even North's cousin, Penelope Disick, joined in. Kim shared numerous Instagram videos showcasing the fun-filled atmosphere. However, Amidst the celebrations, a notable incident unfolded that sparked conversations. North displayed unusual behavior towards her mother, Kim Kardashian, showing a clear preference for her father, Kanye West. North spent most of her time laughing and engaging in activities with Kanye while seemingly ignoring Kim. This behavior was surprising and significant as it contrasted sharply with North's usual interactions with her mother. Despite Kim's attempts to engage with North, she seemed uninterested, preferring Kanye's company. Witnesses at the party observed this dynamic, and soon videos and photos capturing the moment went viral. Kim, known for her composed demeanor, appeared visibly upset by her daughter's actions. Her initial Instagram posts and stories exuded happiness, but gradually revealed her hurt and frustration as the event unfolded. This emotional contrast starkly juxtaposed the lively party atmosphere. Images from the celebration highlighted a noticeable divide. The North visibly content with Kanye, while Kim appeared isolated and disheartened. The incident provided a glimpse into the underlying tensions within the Kardashian West family, drawing significant attention and speculation. <laughs> <laughs> Ray crashed his. Guys, like the one and only Toys R Us. Why is mine going so slow? <laughs> Let's play. Guys, after hours. <laughs> to grasp what happened at Northwest's birthday party, it's essential to delve into the dynamics among North, her mother Kim Kardashian, and her father Kanye West. North shares a special bond with Kanye, evident in their shared interests and extensive time together, contrasting with her relationship with Kim. North has consistently favored spending time with Kanye, fostering a strong emotional connection between them. Conversely, Kim's hectic schedule and public persona create a different environment for North. Past episodes of their reality show and public appearances have shown moments of tension, with North occasionally rebelling against Kim, openly criticizing her, 
or expressing frustration with their lifestyle shaped by Kim's fame. North's perceived disregard at her birthday party might stem from these tensions. There are claims that North feels exploited by Kim for financial gain and attention, exacerbated by Kim frequently featuring her children on social media and in public, a strategy integral to her brand and business. One incident that fueled these sentiments was when Kim posted videos of North singing at a school event, drawing widespread media attention that inadvertently placed North in an unwelcome spotlight. My name is Norfi. What are those? These are clothes. What are those? These are clothes. Whoa! This incident underscores how North's private moments are often thrust into the public eye, causing discomfort. Evidence supporting these claims can be found on Kim's social media. When piecing together these facets, it becomes evident why North opted to celebrate her birthday with Kanye instead of Kim. Kanye's parenting approach, emphasizing privacy and personal connection, aligns more closely with North's preferences. Coupled with her frustrations about being in the spotlight, this has widened the rift between her and Kim. Understanding North's sentiments and the family dynamics offers deeper insight into the events surrounding her birthday party. It wasn't merely a public snub, but a reflection of ongoing issues within the Kardashian West family. Following the incident, Kim Kardashian's public response was documented on social media. On June 15, the day of the party, Kim shared a series of Instagram posts and stories celebrating North's special day. These posts featured heartfelt messages and joyful images aimed at portraying a picture-perfect family celebration. Among them, a carousal of photos showcased tender moments between Kim and North, with one notable post featuring a loving caption, Thank God for you. Happy 11th birthday, my sweet girl North. I love you so, so, so much. The accompanying photos captured the mother-daughter duo in affectionate poses, smiling and enjoying the festivities. The intention behind these posts was clear, to present an image of familial happiness and unity Kim's Instagram stories further reinforced this narrative, highlighting various highlights from the birthday party held at American Dream Mall. These included the elaborate setup, amusement rides, and indoor theme park fun, with North Shome enjoying these activities surrounded by friends and family. He knows what to do. <laughs> Ray, you weren't going to hold on to Kai's and get up there? In her posts, Kim aimed to portray a joyful occasion filled with love and laughter. However, a closer examination reveals her attempt to uphold a positive family image amid recent tensions. Notably absent from these posts were any references to North's public snub or her preference for spending time with Kenny. Instead, Kim focused on the celebration and the festive ambience, carefully sidestepping any hint of underlying discord. This selective presentation of content can be seen as Kim's effort to maintain a positive public perception. Yet, for those familiar with the behind-the-scenes dynamics, it serves as a reminder of the disparity between public appearances and private realities. Under the surface of the birthday festivities lies a more intricate narrative involving family complexities. Central to this narrative are North's allegations of exploitation by her mother Kim. According to various sources, North has expressed feeling used by Kim for media attention and financial gain. These sentiments have been exacerbated by North's recent decision to live with her father, Kanye West, and his new wife, Bianca Soriano. North's claims shed light on strained relations with Kim, alleging that her mother prioritizes public image and business interests over her well-being. These revelations have sparked significant public discourse about the pressures faced by celebrity children and the potential repercussions of growing up in the spotlight. Meanwhile, discussions about Northwest's 11th birthday party have ignited social media, with people sharing various reactions to the situation. One commentator remarked, I think Kim really needs to spend quality time with each of her kids without nannies or cameras to do things together as a family. If Kim isn't careful, she may lose North for good. Another wrote, North always speaks the truth and loves her dad. We only hope the best for North as she grows into adulthood. 
As Kim Kardashian navigates the fallout from Northwest's recent comments and disclosures, scrutiny of her parenting choices and family dynamics intensifies. There is widespread speculation about how Kim will address the situation and men strained relationships within the Kardashian-Jenner family. A pivotal factor will be Kim's initial response. Many are eager to see if she will publicly address North's accusations and decision to live with Kanye. Given Kim's history of using social media to share updates about her family, there is anticipation about whether she will use this platform to share her perspective and reassure fans about her children's well-being. Observers are keen to see how these challenges will reshape family dynamics and provoke changes. What are your thoughts on the Kardashian-Jenner drama? Do you believe Kim Kardashian should reconsider her parenting approach? Share your thoughts below and stay tuned for more updates on celebrity news and Kardashian-Jenner developments.